TFNN Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We had the Dow. Dow Industrials finished up 450. NASDAQ is up 232. S&P's up 54. If we get over and take a look at these S&P's, what you're going to see out here, folks, is that uh, all day long you had climbed a higher price. Uh, volume was anemic uh, all the way up. Uh, bottom line is that the uh, market kept going, though. No two ways about that. And then right into the close, we uh, just uh, basically went from uh, the 2808 number down to 2786. Uh, the futures have another 15 minutes to go. But what it did do is that it brought it right back to uh, before the open this morning, which is really, uh, you know, we know that the volatility in these markets are pretty wild. But uh, that's a number. And that's that number. If we go over to the S&P, what you're going to see, the SPY. Uh, yesterday, you came downtown. You got some big numbers on the way downtown. We did 126 million shares. You're going up with 88. Guess what? You get more sellers than buyers in an incredible way. NDX 100, which always leads the market, which it also led it up today. Bottom line, did 38 million shares, and that's after going downtown with 72 million. That correlation, folks, is a monster number. Folks, when you go down with double the amount of shares you went up, guess what? You are going to go south. Gold. Gold contract caught a nice bid out here today. Uh, the gold equities are breaking higher. They have volume behind the move. This move in gold today, nice move up $49, 187,000 contracts. If we get over and we take a look at the GDX, which is a accumulation of uh, many of the gold equities, that baby broke topside out here today. The last high that was up here was uh, $32.27. Uh, we broke that. We're at 3251 and we take a look at what you want to keep your eye on inside of this is the break top side of the consolidation, folks. Oh, we did it. This is going to be crazy. Okay, so we did it out here today. It's $31.79. We closed at $32.51. Folks, this can be the beginning of a monster run in these gold equities. The reason I'm saying that, the two largest equities have already broken top side, Newmont as well as Barrick. This bottom line, though, this is saying that you're going to have a slew of them break topside. This has been a seven-year consolidation. And if they act like anything like Newmont and Barrick did, off to the races in a big way. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Come back and visit us tomorrow, 8.30 in the morning. Please tell your friends. Great program. Just go to TFNN. Go to YouTube. Go to TFNN. Have a great night, folks. Bam! Look at them.